Hey guys, what's up? It's time for another What Shotgun Shell Patterns Best? All right, so I got my Browning A5. I got a modified choke. Same thing as I have in all the other videos. Also, I wanna let you guys know, if, you, if you're new to this channel, and this is the first time you've watched this specific video about patterning these shotgun shells, um, I'm gonna put a link in the description below that has a link to the playlist. So boom, you can start from number one and work here all the way. You can just binge watch all the way through. This will be part five. If you're already a subscriber, thanks guys for watching again. Hit the thumbs up on this video, it's helping out. These videos are blowing up. A lot of people are liking this, it's very popular. Also, today, behind the camera, we have Pacific Flyway. Colton, show yourself, show your face. What's up guys? Go ahead and check his channel. He has a Super Vinci, he, actually he's shooting today which uh, is a th chamber to a three and a half. So he's gonna be shooting some very interesting, I don't wanna give it out, but uh, I will put the link to that video in the description below and I will also uh, pin that video in the comments. So if you're just going, gonna go comment or something, just go click on that link, it'll take you to his channel and go subscribe to him, all right guys? So let's get started. I'm super pumped to actually try two of these three today. So let's go over here, let me show you what we got. We got, Browning XDs, we have the Federal Blue Box, which is the one you guys have been asking about. And then, has, has anybody heard of these filled in streams? I haven't personally. Now, everything's the same. It's 12 gauge, three inch, two shot. The only difference is, is on the Browning XDs, uh, it's one and a quarter ounce dram, so the other two are one and eight, so obviously the speed's gonna be slower. They say that out of my gun, this shoots the best, but we're gonna prove it whether that's right or wrong. Let's do it. All right, guys, don't forget your earplugs. Put these bad boys in. We're gonna start out at 20 yards, like we have been on these videos. So we're gonna start 20, we'll move it back to 40. We're doing one each. That's the Browning XD at 20 yards. Very impressive. It looks really good. It's honestly pretty tight. And I kinda, I was, before I was aiming like more like right here, but I actually did center mass that bird and I mean, that just destroyed him, so let's Let's go go ahead and uh, let's move on to the the federal blue box. Oh wow, that looks really good. That looks really good. This is the federal blue box. Look at that. That looks good. I would say the Browning is really close to it still, but I think this is even just a little bit tighter. We'll show them here in comparison in a minute, but I think that looks really good. Let's go ahead and move on to the field and stream at 20 yards. That don't look half bad either. All right guys, we moved the target back to 40 yards. We're back to the Browning XDs, 12 gauge, three inch, two shot. The velocity on these are 1450, and these are $21.99 a box. I know you can find them cheaper than that. That's a little steep. That's coming from Bass Pro. They're always overpriced, but I know, I think you can find these, I wanna say somewhere in the, like the $17.99 range. But let's see how this goes. I mean, I, I would pay that if something patterned really well and I was knocking birds down. But you know, there is a difference between patterning your gun and it looks good on paper and knocking birds down too. So the season's gonna show, but let's go ahead and shoot these at 40 yards. All right guys, here is 40 yards. If you wanna take a look at that. Uh, the bird's dead. It's not super impressive to me, but it's not bad. It's definitely not one of the worst by any means. I mean, that bird is done. Let's go ahead and move on to the federal blue box at 40 yards, and then we'll show you guys a comparison with all of them at the end. This looks pretty good too. This is a federal blue at 40 yards. We've got multiple rounds in there. Like I said, we'll show you a close-up later, but I'm fairly pleased with that too. Now I'll tell you guys, this these federal blue box shells are $10.99 a box. And I even seen them for cheaper. Like if you become a member of some of these, I think Sportsman's Guide or something like that, you can get them for like $9.99 a box. So uh, I'll tell you this much, it blows away the Super X and you guys know that that is my favorite round or shotgun shell to shoot. So let's go ahead and do the last one, filled and stream, 40 yards. Let's go. Here is that filled and stream, 12 gauge, three inch, three shot, I'm um, two shot. It's not bad. I mean, we got a fair spread all over the place. I mean, yeah, it don't seem as many on the bird, but that all also varies, right, with the bird flying or whatever. But it's not bad for a cheap round. So uh, let's go ahead and set them all down and let you guys see them all together. Here's all three of them compared. Colin's just gonna kinda give a quick little scan and then we'll go over each one. Okay, so here's the brownie. It looks pretty good, I like it. Very condensed, 20 yards, okay? Now we move on, we have the Federal Blue Box. That by far, well, I shouldn't say by far, 
but I really think it looks really good too. It's very condensed. Then you got the field and stream at 20 yards. Uh, if you'll notice, actually, the Federals shoot have a little low. The field and stream are a little high, but they don't look bad. I'm, I'm going with the Federal Blue Box, guys. And a lot of you have been asking for me to do the video on the Federal Blue Box, and I've been wanting to do it. It's just getting access to these shells, but man, that looks, that looks really good. And the price is really good, too, on those shells. All right, let's go to the 40 yards. Okay, so here's a comparison of all three. Let you guys decide. I already know what I think definitely looks best. Definitely not the Browning. And those are expensive. Again, the expensive shells just doesn't hold up. I don't know what it is. I, I mean, I'm not dissatisfied. There's things that shoot worse than that Browning 40 yards, but it's definitely out of these three right here. Look at the Federal Blue Box. That looks really good to me. But I'm telling you, to me, what do you guys think? Comment below. I honestly think that this field and stream shell, as far as the overall scheme, the BBs that are all over us versus this, see how there's gaps and stuff here? God, that looks better to me. I voted for Federal Blue Box on the 20 yards on the 40. I still, I don't know. You'd have to do more shooting. I'm gonna say these kind of come in in close tie. I kind of lean toward this one, but I still think this looks really good. So anyways. All right, guys, so that wraps up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I, I'm enjoying doing this, and I'm enjoying recording these. I'm enjoying shooting it and seeing all these patterns. I think you guys are too. If you are, give this video a thumbs up down below. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel. We got a ton more of these coming. The link to the playlist for all these. If you're like, man, where's part two or three or four? It will be down below. You can click on that, and it will just take you all the way one through five. And so uh, don't forget to go check out Pacific Flyway uh, Colton's channel. And I'll put that in the description below and also in the comment. You can go click it and see what his super adventure looks like. I think you guys will be surprised. So anyways, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys later.